Hi everyone, I'm Navita Baba and I'm a developer advocate at Meta Open Source. Today, I'll be explaining the project RedX to you in an easy to understand way. So let's go. RedX is an Android bytecode optimizer that reads, writes and analyzes DEX files to maximize overall performance. By applying a series of customizable transformations, a source DEX file can be optimized before inclusion in an APK. The RedX pipeline is generalized to allow any kind of DEX transformation. Minification, inlining, and dead code elimination significantly reduce bytecode size. Minification typically involves going through and replacing long strings with shorter placeholder strings, thereby reducing the bytes dedicated to strings without affecting the application's functionality. Inlining can be done by moving the functionality of a called function into its caller function to reduce the overhead of a function call without changing functionality, such as wrapper functions. Removing dead code while traversing the graph of function calls can be used to reduce binary size without any downside. Apart from these techniques, RedX has a feedback-directed class layout, allowing it to organize classes in a way that minimizes the number of fetches from flash needed to load bytecode at startup, speeding up a cold start. RedX also has the ability to view the whole program at once, which allows it to remove unnecessary interfaces and metadata, such as certain DEX files and annotation from release builds that are not needed during runtime to free up storage. This architecture was designed to be fast with a simple and configurable interface that can be easily incorporated into an existing build toolchain without the need for supporting scripts. RedX produces faster and smaller APKs. Having fewer bytes means faster download and install times, reduced data usage for Android users, and faster runtime performance. RedX also has deep integration with Buck, our high-performance build tool, which helps simplify the process of using RedX when generating an APK. RedX was open-sourced in April 2016 in an effort to make every Android app smaller and faster in addition to Facebook's. Based on the telemetry data collected from real-world devices, we discovered that this open-source tool gave typical Android devices up to 25 to 30% speedups. To learn more about RedX, visit their website, check out their GitHub repo, and our blogs where you can find more documentation on getting started, tutorials, and learn more about how RedX works. If you'd like to see more about RedX on this channel, give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.